welcome to my channel Kelly Coffee and Cards. Thanks for your visit today and if you've already stopped in and subscribed, thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'm really excited to start this new journey and I am grateful for your friendship and for your support. And today I'm going to be sharing with you a craft from the Project Bin. And the Project Bin is a stamp company that is near and dear to my heart and the owner and illustrator Denise is an absolute sweetheart and she has stamps for every occasion from the sweet and wholesome friendship uh, to some that are absolutely hilarious uh, an array of scripture stamps and different holidays and uh, some of the stamps you even get matching steel dies which is pretty fabulous and there's truly something for everyone and what i'm most excited to share with you is the two brand new stamp sets that have just been released um, for the upcoming fall and halloween season including this one called new leaf and as you can see it's all things fall and it has these uh, lovely sentiments like i love fall most of all and autumn teaches us that change can be beautiful and it has a sweet little pumpkin and turn over a new leaf and this darling little owl with a matching sentiment that says woo to the who <laughs> i just thought that was so sweet and i can't wait to make a stamp set with that little cutie and she also has a uh, lovely new Halloween set. You'll notice the packaging is a little bit different on this one. I'm trying out a new storage system. Um, but this lovely stamp set for Halloween has the little witch's hat, some super fun zombies. So if you're a Walking Dead fan, that would be fun. And this cute little spider with a matching sentiment that says, I'm here to decorate your house for October. <laughs> I think it came a little early to my house. I've actually made a card with this little spider, and you can see that on my blog. Blog at your follower. It's uh, at sandcastlestamper.blogspot.com, and of course, you can always go to the Project Bin, and there's an inspiration blog where the design team has uh, a a variety of cards using all the stamp sets available in the store that you can use as inspiration. And uh, these two new stamp sets join the ones that she has uh, in the shop, Autumn's Calling and Haunt It. And this one just is so beautiful and I love the stamp set, especially this little sentiment that says, leaves are falling, autumn's calling. And when I see this, it really invokes the feeling of fall. Uh, with the changing leaves going from the greens to the yellows and the oranges and the reds and the sweaters and pumpkin spice lattes and that crisp cool change in the air and it just really makes me excited to look forward to making fall and autumn and Halloween cards so those will be coming up and a quick example of one that I made is how to use the haunted stamp set um, and you can use the sentiment as a focal point in your card. And I've paired it with some vivid and bright and fun and whimsical papers, which is pretty much my crafting style, I would have to say. And then this clean and simple or cast card using the New Leaf uh, pumpkin, which I have used some non-traditional colors, uh, sort of the transition from the greens of the summer to the new autumn colors and I've uh, used distressed inks from Tim Holtz to uh, have a little bit of a swirled ink color from the orange to the green and this sentiment says autumn leaves and pumpkin please so it's just a cute little card that you can put in the mail for someone and um, well let's get started on today's project for today's craft from the project bin, I'm going to be making some planner clips. Planner clips are super fun and a great way to decorate planners, which are very popular right now. What I'm going to be using are two of the stamp sets from the project bin, and the first one is kind of possum, and it has these two sweet little puppies, and feline good, which has these two cute little kitties. Both of these stamp sets come with matching dies. And I'm going to be using some colorful paper clips, my Tim Holtz stamping platform, some paper, some ink, and my cuddle bug. 
and I'm going to fast forward this to go through this whole process of stamping and cutting out. Be right back. see I've added the clips to the back and now the next thing we're going to do is add some glossy accents the final planner clips and they are just as cute as can be and the uh, glitter glue really gives them a little bit of an extra shine and makes them pop and it also makes them a lot more sturdy so if you're a planner girl or guy that likes to put your planner in your bag or on your desk it helps keep them uh, nice and sturdy and I'm also um, showing you how you can use them in a journal and this is actually a little crafty uh, friends surprise giveaway and I'm gonna be sending her this once the set is complete and um, I hope you enjoyed my little craft project today thank you so much for stopping by and if you uh, want to leave a comment below so I can find you and I'll stop by and visit you thank you so much bye bye